I've got a question. Would you consider your skin to be clear, free from blackheads, pimples, and blemishes? Is it glowing? Bright, hydrated, with an even skin tone. What about radiant? That's right, I said radiant. Gentlemen, clear, glowing, radiant skin. It's not just for the ladies, it's for dudes too. And so today, we're going over six simple skincare tips to enhance your magnificently masculine mug. Tip number one, H2O, baby, you need to hydrate. Okay, have you ever seen a plant or flower when it's thirsty, right? It's dehydrated. What happens? Exactly. It wilts and droops and you give it a little bit of water, right? In a matter of minutes, it perks back up, starts looking better. This is an incredibly weird analogy, but our skin is much like a plant or a flower. You are a beautiful flower and if you don't hydrate, your skin is going to droop and wilt and look old. But unlike plants, a few sips and you're not going to see it just spring back to life. It's all about maintenance. You need to maintain maintain a proper hydration level throughout your body. You do this, guess what? Your skin is going to reward you. It's going to look great. It's going to look younger, fresher, elastic, soft, and supple. Tip number two is eat a healthy diet. There is a direct correlation between what you put in and the way that you look. Let me break this down as simply as possible. If you eat crap, you will look like crap. If you drink alcohol in excess, your skin will look like crap. And if you smoke, you might as well just turn this video off because you, my friend, are doomed. You're your skin is going to look old, crappy, rough and rugged. It's really not that complicated. If you limit processed food, all right, reduce sugar intake, and reduce the amount of saturated fat you're consuming, your skin will thank you. Tip number three, exfoliate and clean your face twice a day, morning and night. There are two main reasons why you're doing this. Reason number one is to remove the excess oil and dirt from your face. You do this, you're going to reduce your breakouts and blemishes. The other reason for exfoliating is actually to remove the dead skin cells. Removing dead skin cells actually brings new, fresh, healthy, lively skin cells to the surface, man. To clean your face, you could do it the old-fashioned way with a washcloth, or you could use Super cool technology facial scrubbing brush. For those of you who have been watching me for a while, you know that about a year ago I found the Clarisonic and pretty much I started using this twice a day and immediately saw my complexion pop. Pop and skin! The only problem is that the Clarisonic costs around $200, so it's expensive. Uh, but for the past month I've actually been using the VitaGood Spin for Perfect Skin facial scrubbing brush. You guys know if you're watching any of the Alpha M Project videos that I'm giving all the guys one of these. So I was like, let me try it. And so for the past month, I've been using this twice a day in the shower and I love it. It is just as good as the Clarisonic for 30 bucks. The set is normally 100 bucks, but because they're a sponsor, we're getting it for 30. There's a link down below. It comes with three scrubbing brushes, one for your body, two for your face, one for your feet. Now, a little pro tip, right? When you're using this, you don't want to over scrub your face, all right? Just like you don't want to scrub it raw with the washcloth, same thing, all right? About 10 seconds per zone, forehead, cheek, cheek, nose and chin. That's it. Here's the deal, all right? Regardless of what facial scrubbing brush you get, whether or not it's this one, this one, or some other one, you're going to notice a difference almost immediately. What's up? You know what I'm doing? Exactly. Tip number four, moisturize, moisturize, moisturize. All right, you're drinking water to hydrate from within, right? But you also have to hydrate from the outside in, all right? It's like a two-pronged attack, in, out, yin, yang. I'm telling you guys, you moisturize, you're gonna see a difference. Your skin is gonna pop, it's gonna be bright. Use one that doesn't have a high oil content so you don't look super greasy. Tip number five is protection. And this is something that I wish I started doing years ago, but I was a bonehead. I was young, I had great skin. I'm like, look at me, no wrinkles, right? Now I'm getting a little bit older, I'm like, damn. I wish I could go back and talk to little wrinkleless me and I'd set me straight. Weird. Anyway, guys, protection, sunscreen. When you go outside during the day, even if you're not going like playing ultimate frisbee, you are getting exposed to the sun's harmful rays, all right? A daily moisturizer with an SPF of 15 is a great place to start, all right? Another place to start, shades. Wearing sunglasses is not only a great way to look super cool and fly, it's a great way to reduce fine lines and wrinkles from developing around your eyes. And tip number six is sweat. Gentlemen, breaking a sweat is good for you. It's not only good for your heart and your lungs because you're exercising, right? It's also great for your skin and your complexion. Sweating helps your pores stay clear and removes toxins and impurities from your body. You gotta be kidding me. 
<laughs> I just noticed after closer inspection of my face that it's sort of funny, ironic even, that I'm doing a video talking about your skin, keeping it sexy and clear, and I've got a massive zit popping up on my forehead. Hmm. <laughs> You gotta admit, it's kind of funny, right? <laughs> and that's it, gentlemen. By following these six simple skincare tips, you can ensure that your skin is clean, clear, glowing, and dare I say, radiant. Take that, you little bastard.